morning everyone happy motorhoming as you can see first night in france on our european uh, trip uh nightmare at the euro tunnel yesterday um uh, took us longer to get through uh than it actually took to drive down from uh, north birmingham a um, couple of various issues you can see uh the french point uh, 10 passport control booths only five manned uh, worse than that though because uh, that was pretty straightforward when you got to that point so apart from a normal wait um, was the actual getting through the euro tunnel for your tickets just old infrastructure needs a lot more improvement but anyway look we're here so we're currently at saint omer probably about 40 minutes away uh, from kinkelly's um, arrived here very late into the evening but nice little air as you can see a couple of vans all nice and uh, uh, flat uh, from that it's right in the center of town um, is a little toilet and somewhere to do your water and waste but that's not working at the moment but hey it's free at the moment normally they charge for this place but it's uh, it's free um i look a bit rough this morning because i've not slept and that is because where our van is here right behind the van in the tree line is a train track <laughs> and yeah thanks so uh all the cargo trains, or uh, freight trains, I should say, have been uh, going past it most of the night. Um, so yeah, I've had a bit of a sleepless night. But uh, look, can't complain. It's first journey. It was only a quick stop over anyway. But this is uh, called Camping Car Hoot Point. Hoot Point. If you look at the uh, camping stop app, uh, it's right in the middle of Saint Omer. The town itself is literally just there. A uh, couple of uh, nice buildings, nice little. Uh, uh, boulanger that I've just been to so I've had my nice croissant and uh, off to Little now which is just around the corner as well so hey for motorhoming it's all there isn't it so anyway happy motorhoming guys